I'm on my way to the Toyota dealer to get the car and the new remote locking and alarm button program to talk to each other. It had instructions with it, but it was so convoluted that I decided it wasn't it wasn't for me to do. Don't know what they'll charge me. Whatever it is, it'll probably be worth it. The old remote that I had, uh, I could push the unlock and it would lock it. But then I couldn't unlock it with the remote. I had to use the key to unlock it. I just ordered a new remote. From what I could read on the internet, if that happened, well, it was a remote that was bad, so I just ordered a new one. <clears throat> Traffic's not too bad. sign over there says photo enforced they they used to have these red light cameras here that would take a picture of anybody running a red light and mail you a ticket <clears throat> but it was the company that owned the red light cameras that made all the money out of it and the, and it was up to the city to collect the ones that didn't automatically mail it in. And they decided it was more trouble trying to collect them than they were getting out of it. So they told them to take their cameras out and forget it. I don't know if it helped accidents or what. Most of the judges around here had said that since they couldn't identify the driver, just the vehicle, it wasn't an enforceable ticket. Coming up on Loop 820, here's where we enter the interstate or the, I think they call this the mixed pasture here or something. South on 820. <clears throat> they were building on this when we moved here and it's finally open now. It does speed things up getting through here, but. Uh, 
my GPS doesn't recognize all this new stuff here. I guess I'll have to get a updated map map sword. white truck up there cut across three lanes and in front of me to get over into this exit. <clears throat> That's the one where was, they were advertising, just walk in, sign the papers, walk out with the car keys in your hand and start making payments on you don't have to pay anything down or closing costs or anything like that. And right here on the end is the service department. I'll shut the camera off because of Well, that was a quick and worthless trip. They looked at the remote that I ordered and said uh, it wasn't Toyota and they didn't know anything about it. And They didn't even want to try it. They gave me a price on the Gia, genuine Toyota remote, two hundred dollars, and this one cost twenty-five. And I wouldn't pay $200 to have a remote anyway, so I'll just uh, use my old one to lock it and unlock it with the key. Well, this trip isn't a total loss. Sonic has her corn dogs on for 50 cents. Sonic, this is Trent, may I take your order? Yes, I want 20 corn dogs. Any mustard ketchup? Uh, no, thank you. 
All right, it's going to be 1083. It'll be right out. Take these home and put them in the freezer, and I can thaw them out and eat them as a as a warning. <laughs>